When you look in a mirror or see sunlight reflecting off the ocean, you are seeing the reflection of light. You are also seeing light reflection when you look at this screen or your hand or really anything. Light reflecting off of objects is what makes them visible to our eyes. Whenever light hits an object, some of it can be absorbed and some of it can be reflected. The light that is reflected is called a reflected ray. And reflected rays are responsible for creating images in mirrors, showing the color of an object and actually allowing us to see anything at all. The law of reflection says that the light will be reflected back at the same angle that it hits the surface. When you look in a mirror, it appears that the image is actually behind the mirror. Your eyes see the light as if it were coming from a point determined by the law of reflection. The angles mean that the image appears to be exactly the same distance behind the mirror as you stand away from the mirror. We expect to see reflected rays when light hits a smooth, shiny surface, like a mirror. But you may not realize that light is reflected from rough surfaces, too. The law of reflection applies for all surfaces. When light reflects off of a rough surface, the angle from which each ray hits the surface is different, so all the light is reflected in all different directions. This is called diffuse reflection, because the light is reflected in all directions. It allows us to see the object from any angle. Many objects, like grass, concrete, and even people, have rough surfaces that reflect light diffusely. Sometimes, as when light reflects off the surface of a lake or a shiny car, a combination of these effects takes place. The surface is smooth enough for an object to be formed, but because it is not perfectly smooth, there is some diffuse reflection as well, and the image is not perfect. White light actually contains light of all colors. When light hits an object, some of the light is absorbed, and some is reflected back as a reflected ray. The color of the object is the color of light that is present in the reflected ray. All the other colors are absorbed by the object. White objects reflect back all colors of light, and black objects don't reflect back any colors. That is why a black box left in the sun will quickly get hotter than a white one. For example, in this picture, light of all colors hits the purple box, but only purple light is reflected back, and that is what makes the box appear purple. If you were to shine a green light on the purple box, it would appear black, because there would be no purple light to reflect back. When light hits any object, some of it can be reflected back as a reflected ray. The law of reflection says that the angle the light reflects back will be the same as the angle it hits the surface. This means that when light hits a very smooth, flat surface like a mirror, it forms an image of whatever is in front of the mirror. When light hits a rough surface, it reflects back at many different angles, causing diffuse reflection. This means that no image will be formed, but you can see the object from any angle. The color of an object is determined by which colors of light are present in the reflected ray. White objects reflect all the colors, and black objects absorb all the colors of light and don't reflect any back. 